Thank you so much to the Montage Los Capos for sponsoring this vlog. I'm going to show you their property through my eyes. I hope you enjoy. Travel with it without it counting as any of your liquids. It smells so good. This is a very early morning flight. I have just checked in and we're gonna go see what the room looks like. I don't think I have ever seen a more beautiful place. <laughs> oh, gosh, oh my gosh, there's stuff in it. What is it? Get out of town. Oh my god, that's so nice. Dulce de leche. Uy, que rico. Here is the situation, okay? You get robes. I so wish my husband was here. There's two showers, are you kidding me? Okay, there's an inside shower and an outside shower, but it's not really outside. Yes. It's amazing, okay, I need to get ready. get a massage. I don't want to cry. And now they've allowed me to come into their spa before hours so I can show you around a little bit. This is where you would come in to get any spa treatments and oh my gosh you guys it is amazing. They have all kinds of stuff. They have brushes that you can use if you forgot your brush. This little amenity section over here where you can have a toothbrush if you need it. There's scope. There's deodorant, which I kind of need a little bit. Okay, come here on, Dove. Come here. You're on your period. You can have some tampons. <laughs> come with me to the most beautiful oasis ever. Gee Louise. This is the spa that I sat in. This is their amazing, beautiful lounge. And this is a cold plunge. It's super cold. And then the jet. They have little fruit. They made me the yummiest drink. If you're waiting for a treatment, you can wait in this little waiting area. This is where you can hang out. If you buy a treatment, you can come over here and just hang out by the poolside. It is so beautiful. I think it's so serene. I mean, I would just spend my time here. <laughs> Yesterday, I came to this to this very pool, and they did a. It's called. I need to know. I need to really read you guys the actual name of it. Basically, they have whale sounds underneath the pool. You go underwater with the technician. It is a very vulnerable massage, you guys. I felt like it was a way to learn how to trust. How to trust in myself, how to trust in this world, this beautiful world. Um, they have these plugs and they put them on your nose and then she taps you on the wrist and then you inhale and take a big breath and she pulls you underwater and then you're like, am I coming out? <laughs> But you come out and I don't know if you guys have ever watched New Girl but there was an episode on New Girl where they do take Nick and he's like ah, and he gets super relaxed well it's kind of like that but way more like technical and beautiful it was funny but not funny because it was so impactful and if you have a chance and the opportunity to do that I highly 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 suggest are from Cabo San Lucas. They're all very deserty and beautiful. I love the vibe here. Mm. 
It is so hot already. I don't know if you can see the fog on my camera. This is what the property looks like in the morning when it's still foggy. Can you hear the birds? That's where I had dinner last night at my scud. I think I'm still full from that. I am walking to the beach right now because I want to watch sunset at the beach. It's such a beautiful place right here. Look, this is their this is their family only pool. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh, but we're gonna go down to the beach. I just want to encourage you to know that God has you in the palm of his hand no matter what you're facing today or what you faced in your past. God can take anything that has tried to harm you and bring beauty out of ashes. If he has done it with me, he can do it with you. He has taken every broken place in my heart and in my past and he has redeemed it. He has given me hope. He has given me a safe place. There is a scripture that I meditated the whole weekend as I was here. It says, no eye has seen, no ear has heard, no heart has imagined what God has prepared for those who love him. Imagine what God has prepared for you. That is the promise out of 1 Corinthians 2.9. Go read it for yourself. Meditate on that word. The montage has beach chairs lining all of the beach. You can sit and relax and have your pool day at the beach. <laughs> the jams. Why do you fill me up, fill me up, buttercup? I need to head over to breakfast and I'm doing something different. Okay, I this is my makeup for today. It's so hot and but humid because they just had the first rain of the year, I guess. And it's so humid. So my hair is not lasting. I blue dry it. I did curls and got so frizzy so I thought today I would wear a nice little hat because I have um, a lot of stuff to do today I have an interview with the chef that's gonna be doing the um, beautiful event tonight which I'm taking you to well I'm gonna show you as much as I can I'm doing the finishing touches and I want to talk about this because it's amazing hold on let me this is the lipstick from bite beauty and honey crisp and I'm gonna show you how gorgeous the color is so nice to travel with because it's compact and it kind of just looks like a little crayon so you pop it open like this and it just is really easy isn't that a beautiful color it matches my obviously that's why i'm wearing it because it matches the dress but it is gorgeous i love how it's just very lightweight it doesn't feel drying it doesn't feel too sticky it doesn't i mean it is a crayon it's not like a lip gloss but it's so pretty this is the finished makeup look. I feel very resorty, very summery, cute, but cool. Cause it's so hot outside. And like I said, I didn't want to fuss with my hair. So we put it up in a little top knot with a cute hat. Okay, I have to show you this incredible little diptyque solid perfume that they just sent me. Oh my gosh, it is amazing. It's the Eau de Rose, which is the perfume that is one of my favorite. It is beautiful because you can travel with it without it counting as any of your uh, liquids and it smells so good <laughs> I think it's marvelous look it cut you can get um, the refills of the little waxy things as well diptyque you're incredible thank you for sending this this is definitely one of my favorite products of all time put it in the bag vamonos 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 a comer Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, I just got my green juice, you guys. It looks so pretty. Tenemos una de tomatillo con aguacate, una rostizada ranchera y la más picosa que es con habanero. Las voy a hacer todas. Perfecto, muy buen provecho. Gracias. Ok, so I noticed yesterday when I asked for salsa, they brought it and it's really, really good, but it's not spicy because most people that come here are from like New York, Los Angeles, um, Texas, we're all California. She said that those were the biggest markets here that come and enjoy. So I said, I need habanero. I need the salsa that's super spicy. So he brought me one with habanero. And it is so good, you guys. It's spicy. Mm -hmm. oh, so good. Okay, Eduardo just brought me all of the selections. Tenemos conchitas de vainilla y chocolate. Pananés con fresa y coco. Tenemos los croissant pain con chocolate, oh. cinnamon roll oh. y el blueberry muffin. Ok, uno de todos. Uno de todos. No, no es cierto, no es cierto. Ok, as if I need dessert. <laughs> I chose the cinnamon roll to enjoy with a little decaf cafecito. Yum, que rico. Coffee makes everything possible. <laughs> Coffee and Jesus. This is Paletas. This is a little shop that you can come. And they have these amazing paletitas. That, that one is a rainbow one that I think I'm gonna get because it doesn't have any dairy in it. This is a place where you can come and buy anything you need. Salsas and moles. I probably need to get that. Stinking food is that. Oh my gosh, this is smallest little molcajetito in all of the world. You guys, this is so cute. Oh my gosh, how adorable is that? Ooh, Bay Republic, hey. I am so happy. Ooh. My husband one time was putting on sunscreen and he put this on his face and this has glitter and he hates glitter and he just looks at me and I look at him and I just die laughing because he is glitter all over his entire face and he's like get this off of me but I love it because it gives your skin the most gorgeous glow so pretty It tastes like horchata, you guys. It's so good. My poolside outfit, I got this bathing suit from Albion. I'm gonna link this bathing suit down below for you guys because it's gorgeous. I love the back. I can't show you the back right now. It's kind of weird, but it is so pretty. And the hat, I feel like it goes really nicely. White accessories. And of course, a long linen shirt from H&M to be my cover. what I'm wearing today. I have a little belt and I paired this with a black accessory for my purse. Oh hey, hey pretty flowers. Okay, it's six o'clock. I'm waiting for the little golf cart to come and pick me up to take me to the twin dolphins house. That house is beautiful. It's available for rent and today they are transforming it into a five-star Michelin restaurant to celebrate the 10th anniversary of Dominique Crenz. Beautiful restaurant. She wanted to pay homage to her pastry chef Juan Contreras. He is from Mexico so that's why they're celebrating here. She is the first woman to win a Michelin star and I just interviewed her. I am in love with her. I just knew of who she was but i'm so happy that i got to meet her i'm so happy that i got to ask her some really insightful questions she's amazing she has written a book and i think it's always really interesting to hear the stories of people who have um, you know succeeded in our eyes especially those who have a really humble heart which is definitely her because she has some nuggets of wisdom that i think we can all learn from but for right now we are about to go to Casa Cren and enjoy a 10 course meal. You ready? Vámonos! I'm 
sabes lo que pasa. El primer verso, papi. Yeah. Lo que manda aquí la clave. Este ritmo guaguanco. Esto es lo que existe. Y también está mi chamaco. Nadie nos resiste. Che no resiste. Aquí estamos bravos. La chema tan brava. Esta vida es brava. Y yo también soy bravo. Por eso lo que repica son los cueros. Okay, the night is ending. We've gotten our last course, and it has been one of the most beautiful nights of my life. Being here around so many inspirational people has really lit my heart on fire for um, creating, for humanity, for love, for respect, for getting back to living our lives. And it's been an incredible journey. You guys, thank you so much for being with me on this, and I sure hope that you enjoyed this vlog. The last two hours I packed most of my suitcase and there's something that I've been wanting to do but I've been kind of afraid of I've been wanting to go snorkeling but I missed the boat yesterday and I have two hours right now to go and do it and be courageous and do something that kind of scares me to do by myself I've never done adventurous stuff on my own my husband is the adventurer he's always the one who's very encouraging to do adventurous things and he's not with me right now but i feel like he's with me saying be here go do it you will never have this experience just in the same way ever again so i'm gonna go and um, snorkel <laughs> getting emotional <sighs> guys i've grown so much in that department i've grown so much in trusting myself and trusting jesus trusting this world um trusting that Yes, it's challenging. Yes, it's hard. Yes, we go through brokenness. We go through really hard things sometimes. But in the end, God, God wins. There's victory. There's glory. It's not just in vain. Your pain isn't in vain. Your pain matters. It has a purpose. And let me tell you this. God has done exceedingly beyond all that I can think or imagine. And he, he can do that for anybody who believes. Faith is challenging because it's mustering up this thought about a God who is so faithful, he will never let you go. And sometimes to think about that is painful because we don't, we, we don't want God to disappoint us. But let me tell you something. If I have not lost the love of God in his favor because of sin, because of things that I've done wrong, because of everything that I feel like I'm not equipped with, like, and the many times that I've messed up in my, in my road to, to, to faith and my journey to knowing God, if I haven't lost his love, like you won't either. He is a trustworthy God and I am, I'm so grateful for this opportunity. I'm grateful that I'm here and I'm grateful that I'm discovering that there's so much more to life than being in, um, confinement to fear um, and if I can do it if I can overcome social anxiety and depression and PTSD and trauma and being afraid of everything um, and be victorious and courageous now you can do it too take it from me if God can do it in me he can do it in you Okay, this is the end of the vlog. I am so grateful that you've watched this. Uh, I pray that it really blessed you. I pray that it took you to this gorgeous place that is just a representation of God's love for you. I hope that you see everything that you see on here as glory to God. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you soon. Adios. Thank you again to the Montage Los Cabos for giving me a home away from home. You guys were so amazing. I look forward to coming back and visiting you with my family.